When Ted Cruz chose Carly Fiorina as his VP uh, nominee or the choice for the VP, he was probably hoping that that would dominate all of the headlines concerning him for at least a few days. But unfortunately, that's not going to be the case because John Boehner chose uh, just today to start talking about what he really thinks about Ted Cruz. And he said this. When asked about the Texas senator, fellow Republican Boehner said, Lucifer in the flesh, according to the Stanford Daily. I have Democrat friends and Republican friends. I get along with almost everyone, but I have never worked with a more miserable son of a bitch in my life. I. Wow. Not. Wow. Playing. Okay, that was incredible. There was a time in the distant past when John Boehner had a fuck or two, but he has no fucks left. Zero anymore. fucks left, right? Damn. I know it was it was pretty uh, vicious, but I agree with him, and I think that he is perfectly explaining how. Establi the establishment feels about Ted Cruz. Now, I agree with the establishment when it comes to Ted Cruz. He's <laughs> way too right wing. He was the one that was willing to go through a government shutdown over, over the Affordable Care Act, right? Mm -hmm. And so, yeah, people dislike him quite a bit. And yeah. Boehner perfectly explains why. Yeah, yeah. The 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 shutdown is is a great reminder of what he stands for, and he was hated at that time. Mm -hmm. And uh, I read an article talking about what one of the causes of the hatred for Ted Cruz is. And it referenced the introduction to his most recent book that was all about him standing up against the corrupt, corrupt Republican Party that didn't want to uh, shut down the government. Uh, it was right after what you were talking about over the debt ceiling again. He wanted to get some sorts of concessions. And the way he pitched it was that they're all craven, cowardly politicians who are bought off and they're the same as the Democrats, and that he was the only principled one who would stand up against it. Uh, not pointing out, of course, that the shutdown that Anna was talking about hurt the Republicans badly, yes. made them look horrible. Um, and so when the Republicans read something like that and they see, oh, this guy's willing to like give a big F you to all of us so that he can seem holier than thou, um, he, in a very basic way, he shares that with uh, Bernie Sanders, that Bernie Sanders will, in a vague sense, talk about how the party is in some ways corrupt, how the donations are bad for it. But Ted Cruz goes farther and starts naming particular names. and. Mm -hmm. Look, and not even being honest in all cases. There's a lot of honest ways that you can attack the GOP, but he lies to make himself look good. And so, of course, they're going to hate him. Now, he did respond. Mm -hmm. uh, he said, John Boehner represents everything wrong and corrupt in Washington. I've never had any substantive conversation with Boehner in any respect. So when he says I'm the worst guy he's ever worked with, he's never worked with me. John Boehner's remarks reveal everything that's wrong and corrupt about Washington, everything you're angry with. When John Boehner calls me Lucifer, he's not directing that at me, he's directing it at you. <laughs> nice way of trying to twist it. Exactly. He's calling all of you the devil, not me. Also, it's very, it's very Nixonian. Don't repeat that he called you Lucifer. You're just reaffirming in people's head that you're the devil. And I love the graphics department, by the way, what they yeah. came up with there. So in uh, contrast to his views on Ted Cruz, John Boehner had this to say. Uh, he said that Democratic challenger Bernie Sanders was a nice guy. And said about John Kasich, uh, the Republican governor of Boehner's home state requires more effort on my behalf than all my other friends, but he's still my friend and I love him. So even the guy who's the hardest to get along with, he loves in comparison to Ted Cruz. Yeah. It's just really interesting to watch members of the GOP rip one another apart. But you know that someone is extreme in their political ideology when John Boehner attacks you. Right? And, and in such a brutal way. In such a brutal way, exactly. I mean, John Boehner is not a liberal. He's not a progressive. He's not even, no. you know, left of, you know, the, far the right. right. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but but even given that, I mean, Ted Cruz is so extreme in his ideology that even John Boehner can't agree with him. John Boehner hates him. Yeah. Yeah. And so John Boehner said that he wouldn't vote for Ted Cruz if he was the nominee, which makes sense. Uh, he says that he would consider voting for Donald Trump. Which is sort of sad. You just got a little bit of credit, uh, and, John then, and we took that credit and right took it back immediately away. 